Hey guys, it's, uh, it's Brandon again. I'm doing another episode of Stick Talk on one of my older sticks now. This is my backup. It's an Optic U, Maverick Optic U, um, on a Maverick A1, the original. So we'll start off with the head again. Um, I have thrown 20 mil in here. Um, this head is designed for uh, an attackman, but uh, I kind of use it because I played attack for a little bit, but then I switched over to midfield. So I used in both positions, and personally, I liked it better in midfield because the face shape is nice and wide. And on defense, the head is pretty stiff. It's not as stiff as like the Rabel or um, Centric, the new Centric, um, but it still has a very nice stiffness. Um, it has the level two bottom rail. So it is designed for a low, mid-low pocket, but you know TJ can hook me up with some nice stuff. So uh, he got a nice uh, mid-high in here. I don't know how he did it, but uh, the it came out really nice. Um, it has two um, sidewall struts on it, and inside the sidewall struts there are uh, two the cutaways inside. Zoom in on that. All right. Um, the face shape of the head. Um, it's pretty, um, pretty pinched and kind of warped now because I used it for face offs. It worked pretty well for me because I like to, I like to battle out. I don't, I'm not a really quick guy, so uh, I just kind of push on him. And the on the on the pocket, TJ got a pretty crazy channel, and it's been like that since the day I got it. Uh, on the back here, it has this USA. I don't know it's how hard it's going to be because it's kind of dirty, but uh, yeah, nice design on the back to add a, a nice look to it. It has the Maverick ball stop in there, um, and this nice jewel, but no cutaways on the throat. So I think if um, they cut away some plastic in here, it'd make the head a good bit lighter because this is a pretty sturdy throat. So. Um, yeah, the weight is actually uh, 4.8 ounces. Um, so yeah, I, I believe that's all on the head. Now we'll move down to the shaft. Uh, Maverick A1, the original one. Um, it had the grit grip when I first got it. Um, it weared away pretty quickly. Uh, not, not as, uh, didn't last as long as I wanted it to, but it was, it was still very nice. The, when I first got it. I still love it today, but uh, it has their, I guess I'll show it like this, but it has their um, their original design. It's their own uh, shape to it. I don't really know uh, what it's called, but uh, when you're throwing fakes, it helps. You can put your thumb here and kind of, you know, twist on it. Um, it. It didn't hold up as good as I would hope it did, it got this pretty nasty ding in it, or actually it's a dent now, <laughs> but otherwise in this it um, only has very heavy heavy um, paint chips, so besides that, I mean, I still love it. Uh, some of the designs on uh, the shaft, they have the shield, uh, they have A1 at the top, and Maverick on the side, and then on the back piece of it back panel it just says Maverick with um, some stripes on the back so it adds a nice clean look to it since it is an all-white shaft uh, this stick not as balanced as my um, Rebel 2 uh, the head is kind of heavy um, on the shaft but only because the shaft is extremely light uh, the they say the strength to weight ratio is um, very very high quality so, yeah, I think that might be it for uh, today. Thanks for watching.